happening, YouTube family? This week has literally been a blur. This past week, about five days ago, I launched my Create With Me Alicia English boxes. On the 15th of every month, you can go on and create with me using a DIY box that you can purchase on my Alicia English Design site. I'll put all the information down below for you if you haven't already checked it out. You guys have blown me away. I added a few extra kits the other night because so many of you were contacting me saying, please don't be sold out, please don't be sold out. So we just went yesterday, we got home about three in the morning and went to get a whole bunch of extra supplies because you guys literally made all my DIY create with me kids dreams come true. I never even expected, <laughs> I never expected to have as many orders as I have right now for the kits. I had a goal in mind for, you know, a couple months of progression with my kits and you guys literally in five days have completely sold me out. I added a few more kits and you completely sold me out. So yesterday I went, I have a small handful and I mean like, an absolute, this is a complete stretch, small handful to add today. This is it. Tonight at midnight or before, I don't know because you guys are absolutely like, I can't even tell you. My site has been on fire all week. You guys are just ordering kids. Can't believe how many of us will be together on the 15th to be able to do the create with me boxes. I had my first goal, which was my three month goal for my kids. And you guys have surpassed my three month goal for my kids. This is absolutely incredible. What I'm gonna do is, because so many of you are reaching out saying, please, please, please don't sell out of kits. I wanna get them on this day or on that day. I understand that no one wants to miss out on getting the kits. And for that, I am so absolutely humbled and grateful that you would like to purchase one of my kits. But I just physically, because almost every single thing that's in the box is completely handmade by me. We're hand creating gifts that are going in for your boxes. There's like so many things in these kits. When you get your first kits, you're gonna understand why I absolutely can't add any more additional kits than I already have. But what I'm gonna do to solve that problem is I'm going to, as soon as the kits that I have that I'm putting up, literally as we speak right now, I've just added just a very small handful of the very last extended <laughs> options for kits. So when that says sold out, that's all I've got. I can't add it, I physically can't add any more this month. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open the orders for the September 15th box. So there'll be a separate listing for September 15th boxes, you can go on and pre-order your uh, September 15th box. If you're not already one of our 12 month subscribers, as I mentioned in previous videos, you can purchase just one month at a time as you go. If you don't wanna do the subscription option, that's totally fine. That's just a bonus. You get a bit of a discount throughout the year. If you know you're gonna buy all 12 boxes, well then the subscription option is for you. And if you're not sure and you, you know, you're on a budget like our family, you can just go on and just do one box at a time. So I'm gonna open up pre-orders for the September box. I did not expect to be sold out of my first boxes and then have to add a few more, sell out of those. And now I'm adding a couple more today, but this is it, this is it, there's no more. There are no more August boxes. And like I mentioned in the first video for these, I was hoping that after I launched the August boxes on August 15th, that you would be able to go back on and get a box. So you can see what's in the box and go back and get one. It's physically not possible for me to give that option. So I don't know how quickly the September boxes are gonna sell out. Hopefully they do sell out because that's so exciting and great growth for what I'm doing with my kits. But if you want a box and you know you're gonna want a September box, then I advise you to go on and get one because as soon as they're sold out, I'll be adding more boxes than I have this time. But because I'm, like I said, hand making every single portion of everything that's going in, on, and around, and everything for your box, I'm obviously only one human, and so those boxes will be limited. So I will put them on the site. If you're seeing this now, the September 15th, 2024 boxes are live on the site, and I'll update you, you know, how things are going with those. But the exciting part about the fact that my kids have done so well on our first month launch for our August 15th box is that for our September 15th box, that means that we get to do an amazing giveaway. Every box is going to get you entered into a draw. And for the draw, what we're going to be giving away is a Cricut Maker 3 bundle pack. This is a huge giveaway for our first month starting our boxes. And then hopefully as we go, we can start doing bigger and bigger giveaways. But I think this is an amazing giveaway for our first time starting with our DIY kits. So every entry, every box gives you one entry. So your odds of winning a Cricut Maker 3 are really good. So when you order a September 15th box, they're gonna be live on the site right now. 
every single purchase on there for a DIY box, whether you're subscribed or monthly, will get you entered into winning a Cricut Maker 3 bundle. That's going to give you the Cricut Maker 3, all the supplies that you need, vinyl. It's a whole kit of fun things that you can do to be able to start using a Cricut Maker 3. So head over to AliciaEnglish.com. I'll put all the information down below for you. And I think that's a super fun giveaway. We had absolutely amazing news today and I'm even so, so excited about my DIY kits, but I'm even more elated to share with you that our dad is coming home today. Papa is coming home this afternoon. Mom is at the hospital right now with him getting everything ready for him to be discharged to come home. So we're so excited. We're gonna go over there this evening and surprise Papa and give him all the hugs and love. Just a quick visit, because we know he's still tiring easily, but at least he gets to be at home relaxing and be monitored that way. And we'll keep you updated on how dad is doing, but he's doing well enough that they're sending him home. So that is good news all around. Hudson and Lennon say good morning. It's a beautiful sunny day. They're just about to get out of the barn for the day and head out to play. I know over the past couple of days, you've been waiting for us to show more renovation progress at Phillips Mom and Dad's. In addition to projects that we're gonna be working on here on our own homestead. I wanna thank everyone for their patience while we've been helping to take care of Dad. We've been doing daily visits and he's been at that local hospital. So we've been making sure that Dad's our number one priority. And obviously this week's been super hot or stormy. So taking care of the animals this week, trying to get everyone nice and cool, take care of everything we need to do around here to make sure that they're all comfortable with this really, really buggy high heat. And then yesterday we just had like monsooning storms. So this week has not really gone uh, in terms of like being able to get off and spend the day over at Phil's mom and dad's and stuff. It just really hasn't been possible this week. Um, in addition to that, I've been working on all of the um, shipments and everything for our kits which is super exciting but this means that we'll be back to kind of getting things back to normal now that we know that dad's home because we can be over there working with dad so it's so excited we're just so unbelievably thankful so thank you to everyone for their prayers and good support and well wishes that you sent for dad because we get to go hug dad at his home tonight we were a little worried what the garden would look like after the storm we had last night but everything's looking pretty good yeah it looks great nice and green <laughs> standing tall beautiful day for dad to come home look at that mom has been at the hospital all morning with dad waiting for him to get discharged so we're just running over here so we can let trooper out for a bathroom break so that he can get his sillies out before mom and dad come home he's gonna be excited to see dad he's yeah he's out he's be a big boy hi good you're a good boy you're not even in a bed when nana's not home oh he's a good boy Oh, <laughs> he knocked me on my butt. Did he get out or he was out? Did you get, he got out. You're a stinker. I was like, Nana never left you out before. Come on. Oh, you're excited to see Alicia. Are you excited to see your Alicia? Yeah, hi. When your little bro is the cutest French bulldog in the world. <laughs> 